So far, I've noticed this game is kind of like Ghost Recon Wildlands and the Division 2 had a Tinder date without a condom. Now, I have come across one problem, one complaint I have about it. As I was uh, leaving the Erwan hub yesterday, I stopped to reply to a text message. A random player walked up to me, stopped, then walked away. Then I walk out and I get blown up by C4 and mines all over the place. Which is, which is kind of funny when I think about it now. I was kind of confused about what happened. I didn't think any enemies would be attacking right there. And then I noticed that I was grouped up with somebody. So I open up the menu, try to quit the group, wasn't able to do that. I look and I see that I'm still at squad privacy friends only. At first I thought it might have been a hacker, but it wasn't. I quit the game, restarted the game, started going through the menus, looked, friends only, still. Go over to options, settings. Third party. Now this is where the problem comes from. Discord. Let's go ahead and reset this to default. Discord, full presence. Uh, let's just go here. Okay, display, whatever else. Display message. Enable our disabled Discord joins. The guy yesterday was not on my Discord friends list. But there is a possibility that we could be in one of the same servers for another game. Which I believe we are, more than likely. I'm not going through the thousands of names to try to find them. Okay, request notifications. Choose if you want to receive uh, invite request notifications. Respond automatically. Automatically respond to incoming Discord join request. Auto accept. Auto accept all incoming requests if respond automatically is enabled. That's what happened. I'm 99% sure that that's what happened. That the guy is in a Discord server that I'm in and was able to kidnap me into his game like that. And that is pretty much digital kidnapping. It's not like a Dark Souls invasion. I mean, in that game, you have a choice. But this one really wants to hide your choice. So I'm not sure if I'm even if I'm going to buy this game or not. They're going to have to fix this shit first. Ubisoft really messed up, that's for sure.